So if you watch my channel, you've known that I am quite the connoisseur of locales. You know, I love a, a, a wide variety of locales. You got fucking King Cobra, all right guy, funny to, to just watch. You got the white DSP, black DSP. You got uh, Chris Chan, you know, a uh, sad case with him, how he went, but there's still some fun, interesting shit to just look back on and, and watch. There's quite a variety, but if there was one lol cow that got me just majorly into just watching stupid people, it's, uh, you know, uh, Wings of Redemption, as uh, you can see him. Oh, my Lord. Ah. But, uh... I wanted to look back on Wings of Redemption, so I went to check out his streams on YouTube, because there's been a lot of crap that's gone over uh, the past six years with him, especially last year and the year before that, mostly during during COVID. You know, you'd expect to see a uh, major funny shit going on. He's just big, fat South Carolina man with the mask on, but that, sadly that was not the case because uh, a massive uh, civil troll conflict happened, and... Uh, yeah, it all just went downhill. No one fucking uh, could uh, stop being fucking stupid and just look at the main picture. And uh, Wings of Redemption got a major win. You know, he even went on to just go boxing live, won the match against Boogie. It's, uh, it's fucking hilarious. But, uh, yeah, you ain't getting no more laughs out of Wings of Redemption, especially since he's now a fucking pillhead. But, yeah, I went to go on his stream. Checked it out once, two days ago. Just typed in the words... Words, tubby, fat, dumpy, just a wide uh, words for a $2 dono. <laughs> it was like, thank you. In fact, speaking of which, I'm going to go take my pill. Yeah. His fucking happy pills. He still takes those, by the way. Or a fucking moron. Then, uh, same day. The next day after that, just uh, threw in some more words. He was like, thank you, Marshall Burns, for the $2. I will go punch my wife. It's fucking, it's, it's silly. And just looking at Wings now, I can just see he has fully given up on life. He's just decided to marry a, a nurse for the medical benefits. That's why he's married to that woman. He's a paywalling shit. I think I saw that he's gotten rid of the Pikachu behind him. Uh, some would call that a staple on his stream. He's saying he's going to put him back up for some cash. He can't make a single dime. No one want to watch his boring ass because... Even if he's playing good, people don't want to see that. They want to see you either act like a retard or do uh, some rage. Like what you used to been fucking known for. See, people like Wings don't understand. This is a little uh, throw out, a secret to all you people out there. If you're stupid enough to go stream in such an environment. That people like to see hatred and rage. They want to see a man just look like a complete fucking jackass. You know, the, the, take people like a... Uh, Tyler One, fucking uh, Ninja, Deller, all those people on fucking Twitch. Those people raged hard. Now, two out of those three people did re did a fake rage. And either way, whether it's fake or real, people want to see that. And they will pay you big fucking cash. Because once you're caught in the major eyes of Twitch and Reddit, you're going to get major cash. Wings of Redemption had that. So six years. People were just watching him. They were trolling the shit out of him. He was one of the first, like back in 2016, first biggest ever troll economics bullshit going on. This was the first time you saw multiple channels being made, Discord servers, built purposely for the sole purpose of trolling a big, fat South Carolina man. Big ups. And that, you know, you see that now on a lot of other shit. Low tier God, fucking, uh... DSP, I think uh, some people could argue DSP was the first, but we never really saw that. DSP started to have that. You now have it with uh, King Cobra JFS. You got people there just watching him, clipping him, laughing at him. Like, people want to see the clips of these big-ass streams that they don't want to waste, so they don't give these people fucking attention. That was Wings of Redemption. Like, you would see him like, Oh, my Lord, and I... Yes, I just had a stroke. I'm going to go eat a Wendy's chili bowl. <laughs> just leave me alone. That was basically the past Wings of Redemption streams back in 2016 and 18. Heck, I would even say it went farther than that. But I can't remember any specific streams. 
that was the fun part about his streams, man. People could watch and laugh at him. Now he's just a boring, big, fat slob. The pills have completely ruined his fucking brains, and he's just hooked on them. Which, uh, if you don't know, in order to counteract the massive amounts of bullying, Wings of Redemption just told his doctors, I'm depressed, I need uh, something to help me. They gave him pills, like they do with every fucking piece of shit that just comes in as stupid enough to believe a doctor. They gave him the happy pills. He's just taking them, taking them, like, keeps taking them. And he doesn't understand that if you take medication like that, it fucks up who you are in your brain. And you think that you'll need those pills. It becomes a drug. Something addictive. He just keeps taking them and taking them. And now he's just a blank gray slate who just yells out just the dumbest shit. You can see the cracks when he's playing intense matches and he yells and harasses his teammates. It's there. He's trying to suppress it with the, gr with the pills. But this idiot... Just keeps taking him and taking him and taking him. One day it's not going to work on him. He's probably going to get back to what he's doing. But it's funny. It's pathetic and funny to see what Wings of Redemption is now. You can't get anything out of him. His stream's boring. I don't think, uh, you know, the trolls have any more weight against them because they fought each other. It's a weird thing about his trolls. A lot of them are from fucking Australia. I remember a lot of, uh, of known Wings of Redemption trolls. I was friends with them. Like, like I'm saying, like, a lot of them were fucking Australian. Like, dude, I, I had... The person I knew was a fucking Aborigine. Just fucking imagine that. You stream at three in the fucking morning, every fucking night. And you always get, like, these fucking Australians just coming in laughing at you. I know how Australians troll, man. Like, no wonder why such a massive fucking saga of trolling was possible. It had to be the fucking Australians. But then the, I, I don't know what happened with the Civil War shit. In the servers, maybe uh, there were some disagreements. I know they always swatted wings. I gotta look up more info on it, so I can't say. But yeah, it didn't go well with the trolls. They were fighting each other. But yeah, looking at Wings Redemption now, it's pathetic. Fat tubby South Carolina slob. That's what he is. You fat slob. Fucking Christ. The absolute worst example of an American is this fat piece of Bernie Sanders supporting shit. Fucking moron. Imagine that. You know, you, you live in a country that gives you just so much opportunity. Even in these days, you can still have a ton of opportunity. People all over the world are willing to get fucking sunk on a boat, get shot and killed by cartels, get ripped apart by fucking alligators, deadly insects, all that shit. They get, like, their legs blown off and they still want to fucking come here. Because we're the only people that know what we're doing. We're the only people that have order here. And they're willing to come here and ruin it because they're so fucking blown out of their head desperate. They'd rather believe lies than the truth. Like fucking a mayor of New York City, Adams, he just went to South America. It's like, people, please do not come here. I'm telling y'all players, do not come up here. We fool. We fool. Yeah, they don't care. They're still believing their lies because they're fucking pathetic. And you got this fat ass... Living off the government, and he's just eating chili. I don't know if he's still living off the government. I know he used to. He used to get, like, a, like checks and shit coming in. Uh, I can't recall what it was for. But, yeah, he's just down there. He's a fat, tubby slob. You would imagine he'd lose weight doing DoorDash. God, imagine that, man. Coming to your house. Just a f fat slob. Uh, mister, uh, mister, we got you a, a, a chicken tendies and nuggets. That'd be funny. God. But yeah. Wings of Redemption, I remember. The golden days. Now he's just a uh, pill head. Maybe if the trolls could try to uh, attack that chink in the armor with pill, call him a pill head, pill person, whatever. Uh, maybe you can get him to get conscious about those pills. Maybe he'll stop. I don't know, but I, I miss old Wings of Redemption, how funny he used to be. Now he's just a boring slob, big fat tubby slob, who, worst example of an American citizen, really. It's a, it's a national embarrassment to see this man. So, yeah, I think that'll conclude my little rant here. Big old, big ups, big ups to the people watching, like, comment, subscribe. You're all champs. Peace.